Super liminal! Yeah, I would have jumped right on this the moment it came out, but it came out hot in the heels of freaking Manifold Garden. You'd, you'd think that with how... I, I don't know, I was gonna say you'd think of how sparse this genre is, that it could spread out a little bit, but... Honestly, there's been a lot of great puzzle games this last, like, couple years, and focusing on them as heavily as I do has really made it very apparent how many there are. It's neat. Let's just jump in here. I'll let this- I'll let it be a surprise for those of you that don't know what the mechanic is. Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent-pending Somnoscope technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnoscope will make your dreams come true. Hello? Eh? Oh, this is gonna have to change. Excuse me. Boop. There we go. It's more doable. Well, hello! Elevator looking- up. Oh. But I was looking at that wall, right? Originally? They're messing with me? They're messing with me. Gotcha. Terms, no, I wanted to read the terms of service, not sign them. Oh no, what have I done? Can I, can I crouch? I can't read the terms of service. What if it's really important? Term. Pricing, security deposit, cancellation keys, and parking pass use. Clinic betting arrangements. Phone. Faculty phone number is redacted. Then why'd you put it on the document in the first place? I have signed this document on August 21st, 2021? The 21 or 91? I don't know. Oh well. Move on. We're never gonna get our answers here. Not today. Hello? Perception is reality. Grab. Yep. So for those of you that didn't know going in, that's what kind of game this is. <laughs> I don't, it's gonna take a little, it's gonna be interesting trying to figure out how to get used to this game and how it works as a concept. I managed to make it smaller. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Hello. Excuse me. <laughs> Oh, that's ridiculous. Terms of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. If you like keep it close to the yeah if it's close to you when you pick it up then it'll end up bigger as a result because of how perception works this will take some getting used to if you're gonna have to interact with this strangeness and we have a chessboard there we go. Alright, uh, do I have a goal? By the way? Are you saying my escape direction is up? Ah, gotcha. A little, little smaller. 
a little bigger. There we go. Aha. Eh. Eh. There we go. Um. No objects beyond this point at all times. Do my clothes come with me? I don't like that filter, it freaks me out. Ah. <laughs> Yeah, I had a feeling that was going to happen. Mirrors don't work, or I'm not real. What? What does that mean? Oh, I don't think that's a mirror reflection. I think that's just what's in the next room. Yeah, okay. Oh, but I can grab it. it apparently that's enough to hold it down. Okay, so that, the tutorial there is that we have infinite grab distance, basically. There we go. Yeah, you gotta be closer to it when you pick it up. So that when you can suggest that it's getting bigger. It's real particular. It'll take some practice. Can I move this over there? Eh. How am I gonna get over there? Can I run jump? Not written on especially. Oh. I can mantle. I can jump pretty well, actually. Okay. Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. <laughs> I do not care about you or your team. Well, I have crazy power. Infinite distance of manipulation. This changes everything. I intuitively keep walking up to stuff to interact with it because that's how, like, first-person games work, where you can pick stuff up. But, uh, in this case, the choice of how close I am to when I pick it up directly affects my ability to interact with it the way I want to. Yeah. I want to get as close as possible so that I can make it bigger... Do, 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 do. Thank you, Cheese. <laughs> During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. Oh no. It defeated my ability to escape the dream. And now I can see out of the cubicle. Like I'm seeing outside of the stage and, and don't hug me, I'm scared or something. I'm inherently distrustful of any narrator in any puzzle game. Because they always they always betray you. But I'm sure she'll betray me somehow. Get smaller, please. I'm sure it'll be like, oh no, I'm imprisoned in this horrible, horrible place. Hmm, that's where I'm supposed to go, so what's over here? Was I kidnapped into eyelids? Warning, Please. you have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. They're going to use force on me. That's not nice. So now that I'm out here, I can't pick anything up. Oh! Except soda! Soda! Soda? Soda! Yeah. It's a mini soda. Or is it? 
Is there a sneaky place I can sneak to? I'm alive. Everything's fine. I get as close as possible to it. If you want to make it look as big as possible. Huh. I don't think there's actually much I can do here, though. <gasps> no! It died! Wait, red soda, green soda, diet soda, random soda, bacon soda, <laughs> mini soda, water soda. I mean, I guess seltzer or whatever is like water soda. Baking soda, though. I wouldn't recommend that. Not a great time overall. But it is sometimes a remedy. But they only want you to get one soda. Otherwise, just think of the kinds of shenanigans that might come out. There you go. Now I've got a soda. Uh oh. How do I break reality with this? Look how small it gets! Get the tiny soda. I don't know, it doesn't seem like a it doesn't this area seems pretty enclosed. Let's see what happens when I break things. Oh I can't. Because the act of moving it around. I don't think you can throw stuff, can you? Ugh. And I pretty much fall straight down. So they get you. Trying to bring back size for this thing. There we go. This is all good practice. But yeah, I, th I think you can't. Yeah, so you can't walk through it while you're carrying something, and if you drop it, it just drops on the ground. I was looking for like a portal style, like disintegration, but I guess maybe they might, maybe they might break puzzles or something. Wow, we're going straight to the, like this chamber being weirdly broken and easy to es like escape from in various ways, like immediately, aren't we? Or is this the intended ch uh, solution for this one? I need to be smaller, please. There we go. Get through the window. Now that was intended. The broken the broken window isn't a subversion. It's not the beginnings of a rat man situation, I guess. Hmm. We'll see. A little unnerving to see broken glass. All environments glass. perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. You can't bribe me with a gift card. No items. Video surveillance. People with, without items beyond this point will be fine. People beyond this point will be, with objects, will be fined. Suspension of dream license for up to a year. Fines from one lost night of sleep to four. Be smart. Thank you for not objecting. They'll fine you with one to four nights of lost sleep? Jesus Christ. Are you supposed to start going insane after a certain number of days? It seems like it's supposed to be a bad thing. Damn. Why can't you guys just control everything? It's a fucking dream simulation. What are the stakes here? Hello, weird chess room. I don't, I don't know if I find this room very palatable. <laughs> chess, 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 chess room. Apple room. Chess room. Apple room. Okay. There you go. Very nice of you. Ah. Uh, see, I'm going to need you to, to hold this door open for me. 
Oh, is it wavy? Uh, I can't take. I can't interact with items while I'm in this door. That's not good. But I think I get it. I just have to make it so big that I can hit both items at once, both door, both uh, buttons at once. Fall over, please. Uh, this is. Eh. Haha. Haha. This is ridiculous. Huh? I gotta get out of here. So far, so good. Please stand by for polite recognition on your completion of the Somnasculpt orientation. You did it. To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. What if I did want to delay? What would you do about that? Huh? Why are the doors falling over? Eh. There we go. I figured I can probably destroy the doors. Oh. I think they might be displeased with me. They seem to have bricked over the door. In response to what I've done. That was neat though. Just went and destroyed the wall. Now where am I? Hmm. You're marked as exit, like you're the correct exit. This is all a dream. Depending on the interpretation of how it all works, this could be like a collaborative effort where my brain and the dream interface with each other in certain ways and interfere with each other. It's like my brain might start to interfere with the with the, with the dream space that's supposed to be a controlled environment. And the two might interfere. And maybe that's why I'm escaping the environment I'm supposed to be in being tested in or getting therapy in, I mean. Or imprisoned in. Or maybe this is all part of the thing. Huh! I didn't like that. Oh no. Oh, an alarm woke me up, I guess? So an alarm woke me up, so I've, I've had this sensation of feeling- of falling back into the room that I originally fell asleep in. It's now I might be back in reality. I don't know if I trust that. This might just be another dream. I might be trapped in layers and layers of dreams. I won't know until I can pick something up. It can screw with perception. Maybe we'll just get some exposition dump or some story or something. That's where all the other people are. Clicking in general just makes the game look just go. Okay, I was hoping to. I just pulled the fire alarm. <gasps> oh no. I made the freaking fire extinguisher run out of fire extinguisher juice. And now it made a gasping noise. Like, like I wore it out. I feel bad for it. It looks, sounds sick. And what did I sign in the first room? I'm a little worried. Old timey punch card. Maybe this game is a 91. Or it's just dreams, I suppose. How to start it? How do I read documents? I want to zoom in on it. I don't think I have a button for that, though. This is my chance. Random soda. It's like uh, every flavor beans from Harry Potter. Uh oh. 
I'm in a dream. I'm in a dream. This is my chance to figure it out. Okay, so, this is not real. We can establish that now. Which means that this doesn't- the punch cards and stuff don't establish a time because these are all- This, this is- this is a non-real location. I'm just imagining locations in general. So this is just like a prototypical concept that I'm implanting on this area. Like in control. Also the fire alarm didn't work, but you know, it could have- Could have just been- you know, something that didn't work. And the gasping fire hydrant could have been an artistic choice of the game or something. But, no. I can make my cans big. That means this place isn't real. My giant, giant cans. I should do the polite thing and throw the can away. It is what a nice person would do. And I occasionally fool myself into thinking that I am one. I'll even make the trash tiny, so that it's easier to throw away. What? <laughs> Did you just do that? Excuse me? What was that movie I saw as a kid? Where somebody's trying to put something in the mail or something and it, like, spits the mail back out. I think it's mail and not the garbage. And, like, it keeps getting- it keeps getting spit back out and then so, then they try to investigate and they get, like, attacked by the mailbox. Oh, that's probably- that's probably gremlins, actually. That's probably gremlins. Help, pull every fire alarm. I'd like to I'd like to leave the dream now. Hey, Mr. Can, would you like to come with me? Maybe you'll be a good garbage can that does your goddamn job. What is this shit? Uh... It's not generally what you expect a door to do. Exit temporarily moved. Would you like a door? <laughs> I had to make it a lot smaller than that. What do you have against doors, or mouse traps, or sandals, or whatever this is now? Huh. Oh, I didn't like. Oh God! It... I didn't like that at all. <laughs> I didn't like that at all. It's a, it's sticking out. Like I saw, I saw the the perception begin to distort, and I was like, I don't, I don't know how to feel about that. Then it's, then I felt it come out of the door for him, and, and I was like, I don't, uh, my brain, I'm not ready for this. Oh my god! It's the Willy Wonka hallway where they paint on a false perception on the whole thing to fuck with you. With how the whole place is, is laid out. Oh my god, it's like a fucking corrupted video on YouTube. I gotta look at the first one now. I didn't go up to that one thinking it was my destination. Oh, it's this one's the Willy Hamonka hallway. It's actually built like this. That actually is really hard to process in my mind what's happening here. It genuinely does feel like I'm getting bigger because that's how perception works in games even more seamless in a video game than it would be in real life. This game is precious. How much can I destroy my perception by also doing this? Oh my god, I have to see this. 
that comes rolling down the hall at me. No! Very important that I center this correctly so it can roll down the hall. This is harder than I imagined. <laughs> No, it won't roll straight. That would have been such a cool visual because it would it, the thing would have stayed the same size while the hall was changing size by perception. So this thing would have looked like it was getting massive when it was the same size the whole time, which just would have looked cool. But that's hard. Well, now it's behind the backdrop. Anyway, I tried. I don't like looking at this hallway anymore, so we're gonna just kind of unmake it real quick, if you don't mind. Oh no, it's on top of the fake thing. <laughs> Go away, shitty hallway. Be gone. There you go, now it's gone. Now I'll never see it again. <laughs> Oh, they had fun with this. I don't trust anything anymore, to be honest. So everything's very clearly like an artificial set. No, I meant to be- oh. That was supposed to be- oh, there's more of them. I'm like, that was supposed to be a ramp. There you go. If I put it in front of the si the pillar on the side, that should give it a sense of space. Because where it, the perception of where you put it affects its depth compared to like, like how far, far forward or backwards it is in space. So I need part of it to overlap this pillar, because then it knows how close it is to me. Otherwise it drops it against the wall back there and it falls behind. This game's just full of shitty little garbage cans that don't want to do their job. Go in. It's a hard shape to put in there, apparently. There you go. <laughs> One of these days, I'm gonna figure out how to trick it into keeping it the garbage inside. Maybe I can block the garbage so it can't spit it out. So when it spits it out, it just goes back in anyway. Hip. 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 Okay, I need, I need another, another one of you guys. Oh. <laughs> Don't fall back there. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. No. Perception's hard. <laughs> I was trying to use this guy. Might help me get up more of it. Hey, big guy. The music stops instantly. What have you done? Even though I've arguably done exactly what they want me to do. Because they, they created the whole situation. You had anything cool up here? I believe that they did not. Create a perfect... Ah. So you can't... Eh. You can't... Uh, you can only rotate it this way. You can't rotate it up and down as far as I can tell. Which really fucks with you and your ability to do anything there. Hip. 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 <laughs> Briefly music. And then none. Alright. Onwards. Oh yeah, and this is another uh, Epic Game Store game, so uh, if you want to use the referral link in the description, then I 
get a little bit of a kickback that supports the channel. So if you want to do that, you can also use the uh, creator tag Sebastian SB. If you want to go forward and check out the rest of this game yourself before you continue to spoil the rest of it via these videos and all that. Thanks for watching like always guys, I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.